See the fox right there. It's got something in its mouth. So I came over to see what the crows and the one or two hawks were flying around at chasing the fox and it turns out so that fox has been actually moving her litter rather than uh, hunting and I'm not sure if she dropped this one or if the hawk attacked the mom as she was carrying it but um, this is definitely one of the pups and it is still alive although I can't tell if it's been more critically injured but I don't see the mom anywhere and I don't know where she went either I walked over to the walkway to see if I could see her coming back over because I saw her up that way carrying something um, but I've never not seen her come past me which makes me wonder if she dropped this and then ran back the other direction perhaps to where her den is now I'm not sure what to do with this little pup either leave it here and the hawks get it or see if there's, uh, I don't know, wildlife specialist or someone that might be able to help. But it's definitely pretty young and would not be able to survive on its own otherwise. Mom, your baby's right here. All right, so we're gonna try moving this little guy out of the direct line of attack of a possible critter. It's a cutie. Seems to be doing okay so far. Yeah, you're okay. Won't let that hawk eat you, don't worry. And we're gonna take it along the trail where its parents normally run and see if maybe we can find a spot where the hawks won't get it again, but somewhere kind of in route to where this kid's mom or dad might run into it. It's a bit of a gamble. I don't know if it'll work or not. But I think if I leave you where you were, that hawk already knows you're there. Your chances of survival aren't very good. So, and I'm not in a position to try raising a baby fox at the moment, even if that would work skeptical about wilding animals like that anyway so usually the foxes come from back over that hill that way so that's where we're going to take this little guy or girl and if we're lucky one of your parents will find you before it's too late Unfortunately, I don't know of a great hollow spot here, and I'm not sure how far back the fox's new den is, so I don't really know where it might be the best place to take you, but I know they go back this direction. So the question is, can we find some place here? It would be safe for you from the hawks, but your parents might also find you. All right, that's the challenge. Of 
question is, where would your parents make a den? I'm honestly not sure. But maybe under this hollow tree might be enough cover for you to be safe. At least here, you don't have an immediate chance that the, the hawk will come get you. And maybe you'll be okay. So I'm just gonna lift you off the glove with just a little bit there. There you go. Well, Hopefully that will work. We'll see. Good luck there, little baby red fox.